Let's bring in the Seahawks' leading rusher today, Ken Walker, 12 carries, 64 yards. You had a long of 15 out there, and at that first half, it looked like you were starting to feel a groove uh, as far as the running game goes. So what did you think? Yeah, uh, I feel like we executed well in the first half uh, as an offense. Um, and then going into the second half, I just feel like we should have, we had to finish and uh, execute better. When you say finish, what does that mean? Uh, just continuing to uh, make plays, like I said, in the first half, like we did in the first half. Um, you know, we're going to halftime, and that's what we harp about is finishing. And I feel like we didn't do that uh, too well today. And talk about uh, your windows, those two t the two tackles went out. Does that change for you anyway in your protection, or do you trying to make sure that you know what those guys are doing or you let those guys figure it out on their own? Yeah, uh, I make sure they know, but uh, also, you know, we got a leader in our center and Gino, you know, uh, they make sure everybody's on point. And if I don't understand what's going on, I'll, uh, I'll ask. Like during the play, I'll make sure I ask and everybody on the same page. Uh, but, yeah, uh, I feel like it, it changes, but at the same time, it's next man up. So I feel like those guys know what they're doing, and I trust them as well. Exactly. I, I want to ask you this question. I know he's on defense, but how, talk about how it was to uh, see Bobby back on this field. Yeah, it's great. Um, it's great to have Bobby, Bobby and a, a leader like Bobby. You know, he's helped me a lot. Me personally, he helped me a lot, like off the field and uh, getting into my routine on what I like to do, like what helps me with my body and stuff. So I've been working out with him and DK a lot, and it's just good to have him back. Mm. You know, when you talk about him helping you with your body, I know there's things you want to do in the off season. You got to treat your body like basically a, a car, you know, where everything's got to be a finely tuned machine. Um, and how was it for you when you're nursing that groin injury through preseason? Um, where are you now? Did you did you? feel confident going into this game that you were going to be fine? Yeah, um, you know, I did. I mean, Bobby helped me with that, too. Like, a lot of stretches, he told me. Um, you know, also, like, the way I recover, everything like that, um, it's helped me a lot. So, like, being, being able to recover like that, the way I did uh, leading up to this game, it helped a lot, and I felt confident playing in this game. Yeah, it didn't seem like you had any kind of effect mm -hmm. out there. And yeah. Do you feel like, you know, that was such a good thing, the way the Seahawks seem to bring guys back slowly and really give you time to mm -hmm. repair and, and recover? Yeah, I think it's great. Uh, and they're understanding of that, and I appreciate that, uh, to have an organization that's understanding of uh, the players. They're going to Detroit next week, and uh, you know that's going to be a strong test against a team that's on the rise. Uh, you go back to, to, to the Michigan State area and back in Michigan. So uh, does that give you a little extra juice? Yeah, definitely. You know, uh, I love going back to state, uh, but, you know, we're going against them now. So yeah. <laughs> it's going to be a little different. <laughs> All right. Well, hopefully that big smile will be on your face yeah. next week right. after the Lions game. Thanks for coming on, man. For we sure. appreciate, appreciate it. Appreciate you for having me. All right.